Hi there, I hope you have a lovely day. Welcome to my channel. My name is Jenna. So today I have another introduction for the project. Same pan last year. This is a project created by Shelley here and it starts today on January 8th and it goes until December 8th. What is it all about? It's all about a certain dates in the within the year which, uh, you know, can help us to pick a prompt. Let's say it like this. So based on Shelley's uh, guidelines, she said, you know, you can start uh, with as many prompts as you want or you know and this project doesn't have a f have let's say uh, fixed rules it's more like you know for example you can do it pen uh, no pen left behind style or you just set yourself some usage goals and based on those goals you work on your product and I picked now the first eight prompts for this project and um, because those cover the um january until march i believe yes january until march now let me get started with the first prompt um first prompt is new year's day january 1st of course and you, you should here pick a new item and i picked this little guy from juvia's place and uh, this is a juvia's place or uh, melissa x juvia's place palette i got two of them because uh, uh, juvia's place made a mistake and they sent me twice this pink palette instead of the blue palette which was also launched on the same day so i got two of those and yeah it's no use to have two <laughs> let's say so let me use this one five times then january 22nd is chinese new year and based on chinese tradition you know uh, the zodiac signs repeat every year uh, you know and for this year it's a rabbit last year was a tiger the year before was the year of the ox the and in 2020 was the year of the red so and here either you pick one of the zodiac signs chinese zodiac signs that you have or any animal related stuff and i thought okay i have already this palette you know lying on my uh, vanity or on my makeup desk why not use it another five times it doesn't matter then you know so i'm just going to show it to you this is the uh, makeup revolution forever dynamic animal ego and yeah I think uh, it's a good thing to use it because it has an animal print, it has a cheetah print on it and based on that let's use it then. Now the third prompt here is Black History Month, uh, February, so product from a black owned makeup brand, so uh, ta -da, surprise surprise, use it another five times, you know, I have it already out, then have it five times, um, you know, another, so in total ten for now. Now, uh, the fourth prompt, Groundhog Day, February 2nd, a product that you keep repeating, that you keep repeat purchasing or a do, are doomed to pen forever. Meant to be tongue-in-cheek. Doomed forever, of course, it is for me. Uh, highlighters, blushes, eyeshadows, I have a lot of them. So this is another highlighter from uh, Kiko Milano from the Unexpected Paradise collection. And this is the light of Venus and why not use it five times so this one five times then another romantic theme number five valentine's day on february 15th here you can pick a red item pick a pink item you know anything that is related to love and i picked here this cream blush uh, it's franken and this is from uh, rimmel london royal blush it's a cream blush and i franked it already and i used it i think in several projects so why not use it another five times within this project so then let's see number six woman's history month in march anything from a female owned brand Ta -da! i have i said you know what three times is uh, is lucky gold or is lucky charm what you say and uh, brings luck we would say in german and yeah lose it you yeah, let's use this one another five times so in total 15 times that's that's really good then um number seven spring a spring palette or an item you got last spring or any previous spring it's a little bit difficult because i don't you know i don't uh, keep track on when i have purchased things i know for example this is one of the younger items that i have and it fits with the name actually blossoms uh, blossom passion the topic of spring i would imagine you know the because the flowers start to blossom again and so on so i thought you know let's use this palette from ace Boutte, uh, blossom passion uh maybe five times it's also relatively new i mean or it's new i have not maybe i did i yeah it's new 
uh, let's use it five times and then roll it out. So then the final, the final prompt number eight here is uh, St. Patrick's Day, March 17th, a green item or a leprechaun item, pot of gold or small. And I have here this little guy. This is from uh, Essence. Is It's an eyeshadow it's in green, you know, mo moss green, as you would say, I believe. Um, yeah, it's like, like a dark greenish color and there is already some use, but not enough for me. I would love to use this one. Uh, yeah, another five times. This is uh, called uh, Grinch. You know, and it is in total how many grams? Yeah, I think three or four grams, if I'm not mistaken. I cannot even see it anymore because it's rubbed off. Anyway, so let's use it five times and then get rid of it. So this was my little introduction for the project Same Pan last year. I hope you enjoyed it. I see you in the next update. Have a good day. Bye bye.